If you want to file your taxes for free in 2024, stick around. I have the best tax software solution for you. And we're going to unpack all the pros, cons, and features of this one in this video. Hey guys, it's Justine with the College Investor Investing in Personal Finance for Millennials. Today we're taking a look at Cash App Taxes. Cash App Taxes is a completely, truly free filing software for your taxes this year. You can file your federal and state return completely free using a very easy to use interface. One caveat that you'll want to take note is if you've moved states this past year or you're trying to file two state returns, Returns, you can't do that inside of Cash App Taxes. So that is the one area if you're like, I moved from Pennsylvania to Missouri, you can't file two of those state returns using Cash App Taxes. Also, if you've earned any foreign income, this is also a situation in which you cannot use the tax software. All other filing situations, W-2 income earners, those who want to check for different deductions, you have investment dividends or bank account uh, interest that you wanna report, you can do all of those things inside of this tax software. So what's new in 2024? Cash App Taxes has been updated to reflect the latest tax code and laws and all of the changes that has happened in the past year. We found that there were some things that you weren't able to do such as import various tax forms that would make it really streamlined and easy. So there is a little bit of a manual process, but everything else has been updated for those tax law changes. In fact, it's our top pick for best free tax software out there and you can check more on that by using the link below link to our blog post in fact let's go ahead and hop inside of the dashboard and I'll show you what it looks like what I love about this user interface is that it's basically a menu of different sections of your tax return that you can scroll down and click start and go into that particular section and start adding in your information a lot of times the user dashboards what I see in various tax software is that they'll have a left-hand menu navigation navigation and everything's kind of set up in the middle. Cash App Taxes completely rethought the user experience and they just kept it very simple, which I really appreciate. So you're going to see your info, your income section is just going to anchor link down to the bottom of this menu and then state taxes and review. It's super simple. So obviously you're going to start with your basic info and then I already went ahead and put in some basic information just to show you what the this looks like. So if I was to do uh, add a W-2, then you can go ahead and add that, what you see from your W-2 and add it inside of Cash App Taxes. So very simply, you're just gonna have all of your tax documents, whether they're digital or physical, and just start copying over what you see. And what I thought was really interesting is as I was adding things in, it actually caught an error. It was too much Medicare tax withheld, and so I was able to adjust that quickly. Obviously, I'm just making up the information, but it does catch errors as I was keying in different information. So you're gonna scroll down to the bottom, save this W-2, and if I was to add another W-2, if you want to upload a W-2, you can do so inside of this tax software. You can upload a file or a photo of your W-2, which makes things really, really easy. If you also own a small business or you do an online business, then you can also input a Schedule C or Schedule K1. So adding that here, and if you hover over this little eye icon, it's going to show you exactly what types of things that you might need. So Lyft and Uber drivers are going to receive 1099K forms, and this is what you can use to input that information inside of the software. And anytime you have questions, you can hit this search forms and FAQs section. You can search for something. Let's take a look at this. You can hit the question mark icon up here and look at FAQs for tax support. Also, I didn't mention this, but you can get free audit support from Cash App Taxes so that you are aware of what's going on. If you go through any type of tax audit, you're going to have that functionality with Cash App Taxes. So any section that I've already gone in and done is grayed out with this edit review button. 
any sections that I have not yet started is going to have this purple start button. So savings and interest. Um, I love these little quick tips. What I love about Cash App taxes is they're not making you feel confused or dumb because you don't know tax jargon because they've completely eliminated the tax jargon, which I really like. So in the savings and interest, it says this includes interest income you received. You might have a 1099 INT. So quick little note about that and then you can click start add in a 1099 int form and then add in that new interest form right here oh this is awesome you can also do single page view so multi-page view or single page view so if you don't want to keep hitting continue you can just look at this as a single page view and just scroll down. As you input new information into Cash App Taxes, you're going to see a potential owed or a refund right here in the upper uh, right hand corner or kind of in the middle of the screen actually. And then you can click on a tax summary. You can see the deductions and they're saying standard deduction is your best bet. They're going to show me what taxable income is included, what taxes owed, credits and withholdings, and then that calculation right here. So free auto defense, no hidden filing fees, uh, calculations are good, max refund guarantee, all that good stuff. And you're going to keep working down this list until you get into some of these other things like family credits, self-employment, uh, taxes paid that you have, might have already paid within the year, and then your state taxes. This is a really simple tool. If you have a simple filing situation where it's like I have the same W-2, I've had the same dependent. I kind of know what to input inside of my tax software, then Cash App Taxes is a really great solution. So is Cash App Taxes worth it? I think so. If you have really common tax forms that you're doing every single year and not much has changed year to year, I think Cash App Taxes is a great DIY solution. Now, if you are an active stock trader and you're actively trading stocks, this may not be the best solution for you because you do have to manually enter those trades and that can get really time consuming. The whole point of doing your own taxes is to save time, save money. So if we're talking about money and time and you've got a lot of stuff going on with your tax filing situation, then perhaps Cash App Taxes isn't what you're looking for. If you want something that's simple, you know how to do things, then I really think this is a great solution. It's been named as one of our best free tax software on our list for years, and there's a reason why, because they continue to make improvements and adjustments. The dashboard is really simple to use. Now, if you're not completely sold on a tax software yet, don't forget we have complete walkthroughs and reviews of all the latest tax software for you to review at thecollegeinvestor.com. If you're into cash app taxes, let us know in the comments what you think, and we'll catch you in the next video.